episode of Super Reaction Bros. I'm Chris. I'm Christopher. Dante, so we're here to look at the official trailer for Beneath Us. This is a very unique, interesting kind of film because it's about a group of undocumented day laborers who get hired by a by a big rich family, and they expect that it's going to be a big payday and everything. And yeah, then there's more to it than that. Things go not funny south, but like. Horror thriller South. Yeah, horror thriller type of South. It's the type of thing where it's it gets very interesting and you're like, wow, this is going to get very possibly, maybe, who knows, controversial, maybe, who knows. Uh, <laughs> I don't repeat that, but still, it's like once you see the trailer or hear what more about it, you, you'll be like, wow, this is getting really deep. This is getting really like, holy cow. Uh, so let's just dive right into this for the official trailer for Beneath Us. So here we go. I could get into a lot of trouble with the police for hiring illegals. Because all that loses the trabajo. Wow, that's just... You see what I mean? It's going to be very, very controversial. No, this is... look. I have a movie guy I follow. This looks like a film right up his alley. Um, but... So basically, they hired them. They forced them, them to fully build the house. And, and then, then they bury them in the bottom. Below the house. Yeah. That looks interesting. I got, you gotta whatsoever. admit, that is such an interesting plot. Like, you can tell too, it's very fucking low budget the way they, they have everything set up, but still, it's an interesting concept of how they're doing it because they have to be very careful of how they deliver this film. Very careful. What? I get it. What? Rich white people are assholes. Well, I mean, I've seen it before, it's just the way they're taking it. That's why. I mean, like I said, it's a matter of how you approach it and, and tell the story. That's what I'm trying to say. Just like how with uh, Get Out of like the meaning behind that, you know, but he took it at a, he took it in a unique route, which made sense. Where you're like, okay, you know, it's like it's there is a message there. Here, it's kind of like the same thing, but I'm hoping there's a message there to deliver as well, you know. And I yeah, hope they don't deliver. trust don't trust white people. No comment. <laughs> uh, said it, not me. It's. It looks like B movie quality thriller horror film at thriller film at best horror film. It it it's just a, a exploitation film. That's what it is. It's just another exploitation film, and that's all it's covering is that su yeah. that subject. Yeah. So I would love to see them blow the brains out of these rich assholes, but far from for me, we're now I will watch it whenever it comes to streaming. Like I say it's it's trying to be another in the vein of Get Out. That's what it's trying to do. It's trying to. Do something like this, but there's no... I mean, there's not really a big, huge, unique twist to it. You know, if there is, that would be awesome. But even if, there, you know, the whole twist was that, oh, we buried them in the house, then you already gave it away pretty much in the trailer. Mm -hmm. You know, to me, I think they would if they would have left that out, I think it would have been an even much bigger twist. I think it would be just more interesting. It's it showing the trailer where they keep them, you know, that's it. You know, they hold on to them, they force them to continue building and things like that, you know. But the big twist is that, oh, by the way, we bury you guys under the house. I think that would have been a bigger twist if they left that out of the trailer. Um, I think it would have been more interesting so when people actually do watch the film, it's like, oh, wow, oh, damn, okay. That would have been, uh, to me, that's, personally, that's why I think they would have, uh, it would have been a better trailer overall. I guess. If they would have sold it on that part because then when people watch it, it's like, oh, there is a bigger twist to it. You know, there is a big twist to it. Maybe there is. Maybe I'm, you know, I'm wrong. Maybe there's a bigger twist to it besides just them burying them in, in, in the houses. But if that's the whole point, then I, I don't know. I'm, I'm probably going to be a huge pass for me, you know, on this film. I mean, 
I I check it out down the road with friends. I like I say it's just an exploitation film. That the whole purpose of the exploitation film is to drag a certain subject through the mud. Yeah. So true. like you, you know that's why we got black exploitation. That's why we got like certain horror exploitation films. Yeah. You know? It just drags the subject through and that's what this is doing. It's mm -hmm. like the whole like undocumented workers thing. That's, yeah. It's just dragging that subject through the mud yeah. pretty much to get the, their movie across. Mm -hmm. And yeah, I want to mind seeing that crazy white lady get hers. That's just me. Who knows? So, other than that, if you're new to the channel, you can hit the like button. If you want to talk to us more about stuff like this, comment down below. If you want to share us around, share it around. And if you like it just a little bit more than anybody else, when it comes to talking about what the rich people are going to get at the end of this film, hit the subscribe button down below and hit that bell icon as well. Let us know what you guys' thoughts are on this trailer overall. Is this something that you want to take a look at to see how it ends or where it goes or... Do you think you got enough of it in the trailer to be like, yeah, that's enough. I'm not watching it. Uh, let's let us know in the comments down below. Put down what you thought of our reaction overall. But most importantly, thank you for watching. So until next time, I'm Chris. I'm Christopher. And this has been a very beneath-filled episode of SRV. See you later. Hey guys, thanks for watching. If you want to check out your previous reactions, as well as our other shows, click the playlist down below. And if you want to check us out in the social universe, you can check us out on Twitter, as well as Stardust, at Super React Bros.